A sick woman who's mourning the loss of her daughter. Her son tries to comfort her. He too is overwhelmed. Jamshid Khan's sister, Tahira, was only 12 years old when she was married. Now, 10 years later, she's dead, the victim of an acid attack at home. It was a slow, painful death, and she had made her brother make this recording on his mobile phone before she passed away. She accused her husband, his mother and his father of attacking her. I want them to be banned in the same way I have been banned. It was her dying wish. She wanted justice. But in this country, how can we as poor people get justice for her? It's a question that doesn't have a positive answer in a place where women are rarely seen in public. This is a culture in which women's rights are few in number. The case of Tahira is shocking, but for many people here, not necessarily surprising. This woman is trying to bring change by setting up the first ever women's jirga, a Pashtun tribal forum, dealing with issues ranging from complaints about garbage to claims of murder. I get threatened so many times. Even my own family was against me, but I will never give up. I'm determined to seek justice for oppressed women here, even if I have to sacrifice my own life for them. Tabasum's jirga has a lawyer who took Tahira's case to a criminal court, but the judge cleared the girl's husband and his parents of murder. Now they're waiting for an appeal hearing. The lawyer says the police have ignored the phone video and the judge wasn't convinced either. I have been trying my level best that this should be made admissible because this is the law and this is the video. So what can I do? Tabasum is a lone figure mounting a tough campaign for better justice. It would seem she needs more support if she's to succeed. Andrew Simmons, Al Jazeera, Swat Valley, Pakistan.